see if we can find some more iron. Ooh. Oh my god, there's a ladder here. Okay, what is this? Hey everyone, and welcome back to some more Planet Crafter. Uh, it's been a long time since I've stepped into the game. For you, you'll have seen the latest recording maybe like a week ago, depending on how long this takes to upload. Um, but for me, it's been over a month, maybe even two months, since I've actually stepped into it. It took a while to edit and uh, upload the other gameplay. We just had a bit of a... Uh, we've had some uploading and time constraint issues on my end and on Ishan, my editor's end. I should say, Ishan is an absolute legend. He's been editing all these videos for me. Probably the last, I guess, 10 to 20 videos you've seen are all edited by him. Um, that might, I'm not sure if that's an accurate number, but that's what it feels like. And he's done it all for free because he, because he's an absolute legend and he claims he really likes me and that he likes doing this. So, yeah, honestly, I can't thank him enough. I wouldn't be able to do this without him. Um, and for you guys who think, yeah, oh yeah, he's a YouTuber, he, he makes a load of money. I, I, I don't. <laughs> I have a full-time job. Um, this is basically like a little hobby for me. So, this is so that I... Ishan's doing this because he's doing me a massive favour, but I can't afford to pay him. So, he's, he's doing this for free, and I can't imagine, like, being able to do this without such awesome help from him. But anyway, let's get back into some Planet Crafter, shall we? So, we... Last time we uh, came across this massive, massive ship. This is the obviously the uh, back of it here. Uh, although it looks like the cockpit's at the front, so we've got the engines and we've got the cockpit, which I'm a bit confused about, but we were exploring it, we were building up this little um, kind of way station we came from way over in the distance over there our terraforming is coming on, I don't have a screen for that yet, this is still a new base uh, but we will be expanding this base, I want this to become like my hub for all of my uh, drills, heaters, and veg tubes. Um, I'm going to make this massive, probably do it multi-level as well. Um, and we're going to utilize as many of the resources we can find in this ship as possible. So, we've got uh, quite a few oxygen capsules. We've got four oxygen capsules and a bit of water. We don't need to carry all the water, but what we do need to find is a load of iron. I want to make a load of storage. We also need to build up our base. So, iron and titanium is kind of a, is a must. Uh, right, what's my... I actually can't remember what my torch was. It's been so long, guys, I've actually forgotten. There we go, it's that, it's that button. <laughs> right, okay, so we've got to go down this ladder. There we go, it's a bit sudden. Um, let's have a look, what's this behind? So we've got a blueprint microchip, that's always good to get. I can't actually make use of it now. Oh, you got seeds and stuff on the uh, bench here. Okay, I might as well take them. I can always drop them back into storage containers if I find them. Let's just check all these. It's been so long since I've been down here, I just need to remind myself of what we actually have. So, okay, there's nothing immediately I need in there. Again, nothing in here is our super alloys and bioplastic nuggets. I am going to need, but I can come back for them. Um, golden seeds. Ooh. I don't need them right now. All I need is stuff to build my base and storage. Once I've got storage, I can come back and grab all this. Um, what's this? Anything? No messages or anything on that? I don't want to miss anything. Gotta be careful. Iron. There we go. I need iron, definitely. Create lots of storage with iron. Okay, that, I think, is it for down here. So that wasn't as big of an area as it could have been. I'm worrying actually that this ship might not be as big as I thought. I was hoping to... Okay, let's get out and just renew my oxygen here. I was hoping that um, I'd be able to really utilize this ship to massively increase my resources. Should I do that now? Uh, let's have a look. Uh, Q. That is Q. Right. Yeah, like I said, it's been a while since I've played this, so I will have to remember the controls kind of as I go. So, what I need to do is I need to build some screens and I need to build some storage. I was really hoping to get to um, the next level of storage. I think you get like a lot, like an actual cupboard or locker, which is much bigger than that. So, what should I do? Should I do blueprint screen? I need some silicon for that. So, I can find some silicon out here. Titania. Silicon. Right, silicon is like a little black blob. Let's 
some more. There we go, some more there. Yep, cool. Alright. Uh, I've got one more space for something, so let's grab some more titanium. I can expand my base a bit with that. Right. And uh, it was that button. There we go. So I want to make a little desk first to put my screens on. Let's turn that around. There we go. Right. And now let's make some screens. First off, I want to get my blueprint screen up and running. Let's put that as far to the side as possible. There we go. So, ah, here we go. Locker storage. Unlock it 50 KTI. Okay, that's total terraforming. Okay, so that's a little way off yet, annoyingly. What else are we close to unlocking? That unlocks at 30. The beacon unlocks at f uh, 5. And a nuclear reactor, wow, unlocks at 6. So we're going to aim for this first. Um, I'll have to build some normal storages to begin with. There's a lot of launch platforms, at atmospheric water collectors. There is a lot to do. Let's see what else I can build here just to... Uh, uh, transmission, screen blue, uh, I think terraformation, I need some cobalt for that, do I have any in storage? No I do not, right, time to build some more storage and then go just grab as much stuff as I possibly can. If I have to deconstruct these storage units and then build them again, that is exactly what I'll do. Let's just build a few here. Okay. So that's got some seeds in it, so I'll chuck those in there. We'll have a blueprint chip. Oh, I forgot about that. And I don't need all this water, so let's put some water away in here. I'll just carry one with me for now. Um, and then this one can be for metals, I guess. I don't need to expand this base yet. Uh, this crafting station. Have I... What have I... Oh, yeah, that's a good point. What have I actually got on me? So T3, there T1, that's T3. Uh, where'd I go? So I need I could do a T2 boots and I've got a T3 backpack. Mine speed, I don't think that's relevant now. I've got a T3 of that. Okay, I think I've got the exoskeleton. Uh, yeah, I do have the exoskeleton. T1. Okay. That's cool. And decode blueprint. GPS satellite. Oh, interesting. Okay. So you actually get to start like launching satellites and stuff? That's actually really interesting. Right. Let's go and rinse this place for what it's worth. I'm going to go back down to the place I've already been to the left here. And I'm going to... How much of this can I deconstruct? Can I deconstruct any of this to get resources? No, it doesn't look like I can. Okay. So, I, I can deconstruct this though. Yeah, that gives me iron if I deconstruct that, which is always incredibly useful to have. Okay, let's grab all of these. There's many, uh, just anything that's going to help me, really. Let's just grab all of that. Deconstruct. I think these actually respawn, so if I need iron, I can just come back in here and deconstruct these again. Right, let's empty that as much as possible and then go dump this back in the ship. I wish you could carry more. I know you can get upgrades, like the backpack and stuff, but I wish I could up I could do that now. Okay, so let's dump metal in here. Aluminium, aluminium. Uh, oh, hydration level, no. I am going to need to drink that. There we go. Iron, magnesium. Let's chuck the radioactive stuff in here. That's not radioactive. Check seeds and stuff in there. Grab the metals and stuff out and we'll try and organise this a little bit. Okay. This is just going to be plants and seeds in here. Then radioactive stuff can go in here. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I'm going to need another one, aren't I? <laughs> okay, let's grab uh, iron out. Aluminium can go in there. Okay. And let's chuck bioplastic in there. And you know what? Ice can ice can go in there. Where's my water? Actually no, I can go in with the water. That that makes sense. Take that out, then I've got a water to spare. 
Um, I'm gonna need food as well. That's a big, big, big thing. That should be... Yeah, see, that's come back already. There we go, that's all of that. Um, if, yeah, if I need iron, I can just come deconstruct these. Um, should I do that now? Because I do need iron. I think, is that one of the back? No, that one hasn't come back yet. Okay, what was down here? There's a couple things. And there's nothing in that one. Right. I think that was just full of iron before, wasn't it? Okay. I'll quickly dump all this, because that is everything from here. Uh, got to use that, there we go. Yeah, I'll quickly go dump all this, and then we will look at uh, exploring the new section of the ship. Hopefully a bigger section. There we go, right. Hopefully I'll fill all this storage up, and then whenever I need something, I just, I'll have it. Is kind of the idea. Okay, so I've done everything to left, let's go to the right. Okay, I'm going to have to deconstruct my way through by the look of it. Just make sure I'm not missing anything. Oh, uh, oh, that was a weird bug. Okay, let's check this room first then, I guess. Okay, I can get through there. Let's carry on then. Okay. Okay, there's a box there. There's a ladder there. Okay. I'm not going to go any further. Let's just double check this room. What's that? Seed. Seed. A grow tube? Can I deconstruct that? Oh, it looks like a grow tube. I don't think it is. Okay. This is full of random stuff. It's still no food. I'm really going to have to see if I can make a, a grow tube. Let's go back out and dump all this stuff, see if I can start making a grow tube to uh, actually feed myself, because I'm a little bit worried I'm not going to find any food here. And there'll come a point where I've literally looted every single bit of food on the map. So, um, let's make this my new metal storage. Right, what do I need to make a grow tube? Uh, veggie tubes. Have I even got a grow tube? Have I unlocked that yet? Ooh, okay, I don't think I've unlocked that yet. I thought I had. Uh, veggie tube, grass spreader, exoskeleton T2. Where are we looking to have. What's happening outside? Oh, just a storm? Okay, that's fine. Oh, not just a storm, meteorites. I'm glad I went inside when I did. Ooh, okay. Where? Is Fab Box Heaters? Are you sure I haven't unlocked it? Food grow. Did I miss that in my thing? Oh, it's there. I thought that's a heater. Idiot. Right, al aluminium and iron and a water bottle. That's fine. Let's grab a couple of aluminium then. Grab some water bottles. And what was it? Iron. Okay, right. Food grower. Let's do that. Over here. We can move all this around if we really need to. Let's do it against this wall. That is really off-putting. <laughs> ah, power. Okay, I'm going to actually deconstruct that. I think I get it all back when I deconstruct it. Get the power back. There we go. Um, right. Squash seeds, mushroom seeds, eggplant seeds. I'll get one of each, I guess. Let's plant an eggplant. Let's plant a mushroom. Oh, wow, that's <laughs> right outside my base. Um, okay, I needed, I needed some more ice, that's for sure. Although I doubt ice comes down as part of this. Uh, what I do need is to build power. So, oh, this takes a lot to do solar panels, doesn't it? It's just iron for wind turbines, which produces 1.2. That produces 19.5. It is worth it. Okay. Oh! Okay. Can, does that disappear? Please tell me that disappears. 
yeah, something's inside. No, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, um, titanium, silicon, aluminium, magnesium. I don't know how much of that I need of each thing, but let's try it. So I need two cobalt. I can probably find that outside. I think I had some though. Oh my god, this rock. I hope that despawns. Okay, I need one cobalt. Okay. One cobalt. Mm, two cobalt. Mm, three cobalt. Okay. I don't know how much, if I'm going to be able to make two of these, but... Um, should I bring them close? Might as well. I like the fact that the power's universal, like, it doesn't matter where you build it, you don't have to, like, connect it up to anything. I'm just gonna, uh... Build that there. Can I build another one? I need a bit more iron, magnesium, and aluminium. Uh, no, just iron and magnesium. Okay. There's the iron. And magnesium, perfect. Okay. Let's get these set up. That should be quite a bit of power now. With that, I should also be able to start building some more drills, heaters, and stuff. Okay. Did I have enough to create that? I need some more iron and aluminium. Iron, aluminium. Perfect. One more food grower. Just make sure I've got enough. Squash. There we go. I wonder how long these take. It's looking like it's happening pretty quickly, to be fair. Uh, does that actually, oh, does it say here? Grown 41%, grown 41%, grown 31? I can't really see the lights too. Hang on. I can't, oh, 0.1% maybe? That's a really annoying way of seeing it. It says 32%. How is that 32% already? Right. Um... I need to go see if I can find some food, so let's have a drink, um, let's create the water. Okay, let's pop that away, and let's see if we can go find some food. What the? Tusker, Pester, Nulna? Okay, I'm not entirely sure what they all do. Time to go up though. Okay, well, only one way to go. Microchip, always good to get. Is there anything in here? Nope. This is really eerie. Food level low, I know, I know it is. Okay, please be food. Yes, right. That should now see us through. Can I get rid of all of that? Oh my god, that's perfect. Right, is this it? Is this the whole ship? Or is there going to be other entrances? Hmm. I can't seem to get through these. Okay, I better head back. My oxygen's getting kind of low. And I'd rather not have to use the bottles if I can avoid it. Let's go decode these. Screen for mapping. A shredder machine. Ooh, I wonder what they all make. Destroys objects placed inside. Okay, so you just if you want to get rid of something completely, you can. I need explosive powder for that. Where the hell do I get that from? Okay. Um, what else? Anything else pop up? Oh, yeah, it was a screen, wasn't it? Shows a map of the surrounding area. I need the microchip compass. Iron and silicon. That's actually quite doable. Where's the compass microchip? Okay, that requires quite a bit. Um, aluminium. Not that one. Not that one. That one! Aluminium. Um, I us just go and collect a load of resources from out here, because there was quite a bit here. Okay, compass. Yes, I've got enough. Okay, and now... Mapping screen I can make. Show interface. No satellite in orbit. Damn it. Okay, I need a satellite to be able to view that. That's kind of annoying. What else can I make? Two silicon I need to get transmissions through. Um, I could 
do with getting the screen to do that. All of it requires silicon. Um, of which I have some space now, so let's go see if I can get some. I'm glad I've uh, not been caught outside in a meteor storm yet. Please don't do that now. That would be bad. Okay, uh, I need my terraformation screen. Oh, that's a big one. Uh, can I put it here? There we go. And if I put another desk down... Uh, desk, desk, desk. Where have we gone? Ah, there it is. I'll try and put uh, things like this kind of off-center a little bit. There we go. So, we're using 75 kilowatts an hour and producing 97. I will need some more solar panels at some point. Okay, what other screens do I need? Uh, I've got power, I probably need that. I've got the blueprints. Progress on terraformation stages could be useful. Do I overlap them? There we go. Good, I can still see everything. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. Have I got any more transmissions? No communication antenna in range. Okay. Um... Yeah, I think this is another big one, so I can put this on the other wall. And iron, silicon, and cobalt. More silicon. Yay! Right, join me in a bit, guys, when i found some silicon. <laughs> okay, I think we've got all the resources we need now to finish making those screens. And maybe start expanding our base a little bit here. And I think it's now that I know that this ship isn't as big and as full of resources as I thought it would be, I'm hesitant to make this my, like, proper main base, but... Um... So I don't really have a huge amount of choice. Oh, it's got to be around this way. That makes sense. Right, let's pop that there. Okay, so at the moment we're barren. We're 21% of the way to blue sky. 22% nearly. Okay, that puts it into perspective. So we've got quite a long way to get to next. next <laughs> quite a long way to go to get to the next stage. I need to focus all my resources on power and growing veg tubes, making heaters, and drills. Okay, can I, is this ready yet? Can I open food grower? No. What's the percentage on it? 77%, 77%, 68%, <laughs> nearly giggity. Right, let's have something to drink. Make a little bit more water here. Let's make a couple. Um, pray to whoever I need to pray to that these grow very quickly. I've got 20% left um, and no food. I don't know if I've got food in the other places. Maybe I do. Okay. I need to build some more power though. So cobalt and aluminium. Um, there's some ice in there. Let's chuck the rest of the ice in there I think. And I need cobalt. Don't have any more cobalt. I need cobalt and aluminium. Let's see if we can find any of that. Food level low. I'm aware. Food grower is at 87%. What happens if I run out of food? Do I do I die? I'm not sure. Do I just suffer a bit of uh Wait, do I have a apparently I have enough aluminium. Okay, well let's go <coughs> pop another one of these down. Over my solar farm. Can I do two? I can do two. Perfect. That should be enough power for quite a bit of time. Now I can start focusing on some veg tubes. What I might do is make some separate floors, maybe? A floor for heaters and a floor for veg tubes. That would be quite a good idea. What do I need for a ladder? Uh, ladder. Some iron. Do I have any more iron? So I seriously not have any iron? That's kind of annoying. I got one iron. Yay. Right. Indoor ladder. Uh, but I need iron to make... I need two iron to make a living compartment and titanium. Right. Titanium and iron. As much of it as I can find. And hope that the food grows quickly. Uh, what are we on? 
Yes! Oh, we're in Troy Fault. Uh, easily fixed. Let's get rid of this. Go! Okay, I'm gonna need a lot of that. I'm gonna need a lot of that. That hardly filled me up at all. Um, that's on 89%, so that's gonna be done soon. Do I need to go some more food growers to be able to do this? I probably do. Okay. Um, do I have enough for another one? I need another water bottle, that's, that's fine. Okay, it doesn't really matter what I'm growing, let's just make sure I am growing stuff. Okay, let's uh, check out my power screen, which is over here, make sure I'm producing enough power. 136, so I've got 30 spare. Okay. Let's grab that metal back out that I was collecting. And we'll chuck this in there. There we go. Okay. Let's... Uh, here we go. Living compartment. Uh, oh, I need some more iron. Okay, let's go deconstruct a load of stuff in here to get some iron. Okay, there's two here I can deconstruct. And two here I can deconstruct. That's four iron already. That's two more living spaces. We can deconstruct that crate. Any more crates? See, there isn't as much in here as I really thought there would be. Let's see. I need some water, that's fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I think I got seven from doing that, which is not bad, but it's not amazing. Ah, no. Darn it. Oh, can I not? Ah, oh, that's annoying. Ah, okay. I need a ladder. Okay, that's gonna be... I need to grab these as soon as they're grown. Um... Okay, I think they squashed it quite a lot then. Uh, ladder. Ladder, ladder, ladder. Where do I want to put it? I need some co Why do I need cobalt for a ladder? That's... Seems weird, but whatever. Um, let's put it here. There we go. Right. So at the moment we're a little bit L-shaped, but that's fine. Let's see if we can find some more iron. Ooh. Oh my god, there's a ladder here. Okay, what is this? So guys, the ship is over there. My base is like there. I've come behind this rock and there's a ladder here. There's... Oh my god, there's like a little bunker in here. Oh my god, right, okay. So what's he got in it? So I needed the iron anyway. There's space food, thank you. Blueprints. Um, okay, I'm going to have to come back for all of this. What does this say? Our ship has crashed for an unknown reason on this planet. Many of us died on impact, some of us died on the surface. I'm the only one left. I tried to survive, but the land is too hostile, my health is getting bad. I'm going outside one last time to try and find some water. Well, they obviously don't know how to turn ice into water then. There's loads of it when I'm here. Oh, this is so cool. Can I deconstruct this? I can deconstruct the locker. I don't know if I get a blueprint for it. Let's just carry as much as I can back, and we'll come back. That's really cool. That didn't... Oh, that didn't replenish my oxygen, though. Okay, um, so we're now at 25%, so it's going up slowly. I'm not deconstruct, might chip. Torch T2. Oh, didn't realise I could even get a T2 torch. Um, let's head back out that way. Actually, let's make the rest of my base first. Go. Okay. I need a way to get up on the outside, so this is fine. It only takes one iron to make stairs, so that's actually okay. 
That'll do for now. I need to deconstruct this. Okay, and I still need more iron. One... Just two more? It's just two more. Perfect. Okay. Let's go restore more oxygen, and we'll head back over to that little thing I found, try and clear it out. 